Chip Tulsa surprised Southern Illinois today. They'll play Southwest Missouri State. That'll be a dandy. Shane Neal misses the first. His brother, a terrific free throw shooter at Georgia Tech, plays in the WBL. And Shane, six of eight until then, six of nine now on the year. One more, and the freshman cans that and gives his team a six-point lead. Under a minute to play here in Asheville. Silvers four in the game off the bench. No, Dennis to follow. No, third time blocked, but he's fouled. Good effort by Dennis. And boy, did Sneed, who gives up about four inches, battle him all the way. Well, of course, it was not just second effort. It was third effort. He got up and down very quickly, and he just stayed after it until they got it in the goal. Both teams now with ten fouls, and the substitution, Neal, will leave. This is interesting. Tim Brooks has not been in the game yeah. since early in the half, and he leads his team in steals. His statistics are very impressive. He's only the third leading scorer, but he does a lot of different things for UT Chattanooga. He leads the conference in assists and steals. Look at the effort by Dennis here. Greg Dennis just stays after. Dennis misses the first free throw. He's a good shot from the line, 76% on the year. Trying to make this a five-point game with 37 seconds left in the first half. That one rocked, rattled, and rolled through. Brooks is Sutton out now. If the ankle is bad, he'll have to really pick up the slack. Of course, Palmer is all over him, and a lot of substitutions by East Tennessee State to keep a fresh defensive team on the floor, and it's paid off for him. Chattanooga will play for the last shot. You see the... Game clock, the shot clock is turned off. Only 10 seconds left. They need to be in their offensive set right now. And Brooks will try to create. He can't. Somebody better shoot. It's going to have to be red and stripped. And here's the shot at the buzzer. It wouldn't have counted anyway. A wild first half in Asheville, North Carolina. The Southern Conference Championship with the winner going on to the big party. And right now, UTC with the advantage. Here's John Saunders. 